along the x axis according to the law x is equal to a sin square omega t minus pi by 4 what is the amplitude of motion of the particle the equation of shm is given as x is equal to a sin square omega t minus pi by 4 and we have to find the amplitude of shm now equation of shm cannot be sin square sin cube cos square cos cube it should be in linear form matlab equation should be like sin omega t or cos omega t or sin omega t plus cos omega t it cannot be in this form sin square cos square sin cube cos cube it is not an equation of shm so first of all what you have to do is bring this equation in that form means uh, naturally you have to use trigonometry we know that sin square 2 sin square theta is 1 minus cos 2 theta this is a, a formula in trigonometry or you can say sin square theta is equal to 1 minus cos 2 theta by 2 so this formula you can use here therefore this equation will become x is equal to a into in place of sin square theta we will write this 1 minus cos 2 theta is omega t minus pi by 4 by 2 so x is equal to this 2 you can take here a by 2 into bracket 1 minus cos 2 omega t minus pi by 4 now this equation is in linear form so what is the frequency angular frequency it is 2 omega omega ki jagah par yahan pe kya hai 2 omega we have to find amplitude so what is the amplitude from this formula it is a by 2 so the amplitude of this motion is a by 2 so your answer is a